In this tutorial, I'll show you how to add a subdomain on your Plex panel. So I'm already logged in into my Plex panel on hard uh, uh, subdomain. Click on hard subdomain. Okay, choose whichever domain you want to add a subdomain to. I'll choose joshwp.com. And I'll add the site. And I'll add uh, test joshwp.com. That's good. Click OK to confirm. Okay. Close. Let's go back to websites and domains. Give it a second to load. We are back. So this is our subdomain. We want to add DNS records to go into this subdomain. I'm using Cloudflare. I'll go to Cloudflare. I want to add a new record. And it's a CNAME record because it's a subdomain. So click on CNAME. Test. The tagline is joshwp.com. That is the target. And then click save. That's good. Okay, we want to issue an SSL certificate. A free SSL certificate. We'll be issuing uh, let's encrypt certificate. Give it a second to load. Okay, scroll all the way down and then click install. Get it for free. Then you're done. Okay, some few features enable HSTC, OS, OCSP, and everything looks good. So the PH version is good. Install WordPress now. Click install WordPress. Give it a second. Okay, leave the directory path, solution path blank. Website I don't want to call it test.joshwp.com or just josh test.josh and then install. Login. Set us for. I always want to clear every plugin. So click on the public action, delete, then apply. Delete everything. That's good. Go to setting under permalink. Want to go to permalink. Want to change the permalink settings to avoid a 404 error. As you can see, we realize that uh, the custom structure we have, we have the site will be loading it dot php we don't want it to be a php so we want to change this to something different so we'll change it to post and then click on post name and then scroll down to save changes so this is our website